everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel today i have decided that it's finally time for me to reorganize these drawers because to be honest they just it's annoying me like i like this bottom drawer because all the tier stuff is together it would help if you could see it wouldn't it um so i like this because all the tier stuff is like literally right there like it's easy to access blah 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 when it comes to the sparkle supplies uk stuff it's really annoying because all this here is sparkle supplies uk then in here we've got this tray here that is all sparkle supplies uk and then we've got obviously this drawer which is just totally sparkle supplies so that's all well and good like in this drawer but it's literally dotted around three drawers so i'm hoping that i'll be able to put all of the sparkle supply stuff within two drawers so like i need to take all this out i think i'm probably going to just keep all this in here but instead of instead of having like these big pots and loads of little ones i'm going to put these big pots in here so these are all large pots and then hopefully i will be able to fit all of the small parts in the same place so it'll be a case of like having all this random stuff um with the tears stuff that's my plan i also need to rearrange the top three drawers which have got all the um what's it called i've just took one out to show you obviously i can't show you this side because it's got a name on it but these they've got names on the bottoms they're for my, my clients files and stuff so inside them they've got like two files like two different grits and then a cuticle oil pen so all my clients have one each and these two drawers at the top and this one this one is half full and these two at the top are full of them um so i really need to like sort those out and put like because some of my clients obviously most of them come like every three or four weeks and then there is a few a few boxes in there not that many to be fair but there's a few in there that like are of people that come when they like have an event like they're on holiday or they want some christmas nails like i have some clients like that as well who don't get their nails done all year round but when they do get them done they come to me which obviously i'm very grateful for but i need to like sort them out and have the bottom drawer as those clients who don't come as regular because then i know when i'm looking for a regular box that it's in the top two if that makes sense so i'm actually going to do that like obviously off camera because that's got names involved and i can't have names of clients on my channel and stuff so i'm going to do that away from the camera but i'm going to do these three with you um so let me just put this box back in this drawer so first things first i'm going to take all these small pots out of here because like i said i want this um i'm not really bothered about color coordination at this point like i just i know that's going to upset a lot of people <laughs> but the thing is like there's glitter mixes in here that have got like four different glitter colors in one like in one part and i just i don't know how you lot like sort those into colours because it just stressed me out having a red one that's got a bit of orange in it like with the reds and stuff so I'm not bothered about that anymore Um, I find it relatively easy to just skim through them and see them anyway so I don't really find it that important I know that some people are going to disagree with that but this is just what works best for me which is obviously most important because I'm the one that's got to use these products and access them regularly so i'm gonna like i said pop these big pots down here so these ones in in this like pot here let's just zoom in oh that's not in that's out phone's back to front and it's really confusing let's put the flash on so we can see them better so these ones in here are like the most recent ones that i've bought most recently like in vip boxes or in like mystery packs like that sort of thing um that actually isn't sparkle supply so i'm going to take that out i like to have all the brands like all together but there's some really beautiful ones in it like poison ivy is just uh, dreamy look at this one i really want to do something with this like along the lines of bees because i just think that's really cute and i've never done anything like that before so might as well give it a go but yeah so these are all separate because of that reason like for no other reason other than they are newest and obviously i just didn't really have the space so I've just thrown them somewhere I could fit them basically as professional as that sounds so I'm just popping them I don't know whether to do because they're going to be loose if I do them like that I know it's going to really wind people up let's just move you over here so you can see what I'm doing I know it's going to really wind people up if I have them sideways in like this area but then this way in that area but I just I feel like we're going to fit more in if I do that. So let's just see how many I can get in doing it this way round. And then we'll compare that to how many I'd get in if I did it the other way round. Because if it's the same, then we might as well keep them the same way round just to prevent any upset. 
but if you get more the other way around then I'm not really that bothered about how they look I could rather just fit more in to be honest right one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen but if I turn them around I think it's going to be about the same because it seems that like having two this way is basically the same width as the other. oh I can get one more in this way round hmm should I turn them all round and have them this way round again I can't remember why I stopped doing that I might actually do that why do I like to make my life so difficult I'm really tempted now to have them this way round I can't the problem is like I had them this way round before and I obviously for some reason didn't like it because I turned them round again. But now I feel like I should do it this way because I can clearly fit more in that way. And I've still got like all these in this box that I need to fit in. So I feel like this is like sort of the way forward just to be able to fit. Just to be able to fit them in. I've got like little ones at the back to keep them where they are at the moment. Else they'd be moving around too much. So maybe it makes more sense to have them the other way around. Why didn't why did I change it in the first place? See, this is annoying. I need to start making notes of why I change things. Because then I can refer back to my notes, see that I've already done that, and see that it was clearly a bad idea because I ended up hating it for some reason, to go back to how it was before. But here we are. I'm already doing it now, so what am I supposed to do? I don't know. I don't know what to do. Somebody help me. You can't help me. This is not live. <laughs> Right, I'm going to do this on a time lapse because obviously it's going to take me a while. So let's just get this done, see what I feel like. Okay, that's this drawer done, thank God, finally got there. I've had to use some space up here because I didn't fit that many more in than I thought I would. Um, I think that's all the big, oh, there's one here. So that's all the big, like, tubs of sparkle supplies now, like, in a, in a space, which is obviously good. That's what we're aiming for. Okay, so next drawer, I'm going to transfer all the sparkle supplies stuff into this one. Um, and then we'll see like how much space we've got because I've got all of these, all of this, and all of these that need to go in there. So that's the next task. First of all, I'm going to take everything out, like all the sparkle supply stuff. I'm going to take it all out of this drawer. Okay, so I've took them all out of that drawer. We've got about three rows of these small ones to get in here. So I'm gonna pop something at the back. I might get another one of these. Right, I'm gonna put all of these ones. You can't even see what I'm doing. I'm just talking to you about nothing. So I'm gonna put all of these on this one. Oh, see the problem is I need both of those to keep those still. Hmm, what am I going to do? I could actually just keep these in, like, these sorts of things. I've got a few spare. And just move some stuff around. I can worry about that another time. So, I've got... Sorry, I know you can't see what I'm doing. I'm literally just getting some pots tidied up so I can use those. Okay, my phone cut off because I ran out of storage because I keep forgetting to delete pictures and videos that I've already uploaded and stuff. So here we are. Um, but yeah, I want a separate one for... So I've decided to do it like this and I want a separate one for um, 
like effects and stuff so shapes uh dust embellishments like that sort of thing i want them in a separate one like leaf and things so i'm just going to pop all those in this end one and then i know that any that i've got in these ones are glitter and not shards or something like that so that's the route i've decided to go down so i'm just checking that every oh god that every one that i put in here is that's shards is actually a glitter and not something like special effecty if that makes sense it didn't make sense when I explained it the first time on the video that just cut out either. So hopefully that was a better shot. <laughs> so I'm just checking them all. They'll all get mixed up eventually anyway, which is highly annoying. But that's my own fault. Like, I can't really blame anyone else. It's my own fault for not putting them back where I get them from all the time. But there you go. At least I know it's my fault and admit it. <laughs> See, this is where it gets annoying now because when there's a gap at the end, they all just do whatever they like. So I think I am going to have to put some in the end as well. So it will be the wrong way round, but at least it keeps them all still, which is most important. Okay, it's a case of just sorting out these ones now which are all like the special effect sort of things so i'm just going to pop them all in here first apologies that was a horrible noise um so i'm going to get all the nuggets i think that's what they're called no that's not even what i thought they were right hold on let's just sort those out I don't think they are Sparkle Supplies products, which means that I don't know where those nuggets are. Where have I put those then? Oh no, I do. They are in here. They're just hiding. Okay, that's fine. So these are what I was talking about. If it will focus. These little, I've obviously showed them in a video before because I would have done a haul video with them, but look how beautiful they are. And they come in loads of different colours as well. So you've got turquoise that I've already just put in there. That's obviously gold. We've also got purple. This purple colour is beautiful as well. Very pretty. Um, and then we've got red, um, copper. Look how beautiful that colour is. Um, where's the others? And then we've got silver, which are obviously, you know, silver. Pretty, pretty self-explanatory. We've got blue. Look at that colour blue, though. Wow. Sorry about blinding you there. Um, then we've got some multicoloured ones. How many is there? Two, four, six, seven, eight. I think that might... Oh, no, there's another one here. So there's pink as well. I think that's it. I think there's nine. So then we've got the... like These are like shard sort of things beautiful so we've got blurple in those um and here's one Fant fantasia which are like multicolored ones that's pink crush blue crush i need to locate those because there's more crushes than just two i'm sure there is that's another one yeah rainbow that replaces that um I think that might be it then i'm pretty sure i'm missing a few things here like that i've put in the wrong place like that one is not a glitter soda pop is definitely shards so that's in the wrong place also which means i need another glitter out of here to replace it i've obviously not done very well at looking through these 
but I'm sure there's also shards. Yeah, hollow rose I'm missing. Um, hopefully, that's it. Are they shards? No, that's a glitter. I need to sit differently. I'm sat so awkward. Um, they're shards, I think. Well, Pinko's technically not, but I actually use those more as shards, so I'm going to take those out as well. Which is very frustrating because that means I'm, I've not got anything here now. But there we go. I might need that as an overflow, so it's fine. So this is just a case now, like with this with this tub that I'm sorting out. It's just really a case of like filling gaps. It's almost like a what's it called? Like a, a jigsaw. <laughs> So let's so move that, pop that there. And then we've got more shards. There are shards as well. And then we've got ultra hollow pink. Uh, fizzy orange shards, they're beautiful. And then we've got Medusa. Um, I think that's it for sure. Oh no, oh gosh, there's the gold shards. And I think that's it. So I'm going to move on to like Mylar and this mirror mix of shapes sort of thing. And then I'm going to go in with like leaf. And then the rest is just pigments and stuff like that. So we're just going to pop those in in any way that they'll fit, basically. And that was quite good. And then that's it for this one. It's actually filled it beautifully. It's not very often it goes that well. So I'm happy with that. And then we've still got a little bit of room to grow as well, which is perfect. For now, I'm going to pop these in as well. Um, just because obviously we've got a gap, but I can take them out when I need to. I don't think... I don't know whether I got these from Sparkle Supplies or not. I'll have to have a look over my previous orders um, because obviously I like to keep them all like together, like the brands like I mentioned. So I'm not sure, but I'm going to just pop these in anyway. They're not going to fill the gap though. So I'm feeling like I might need to find like a space saver for now until I've got enough to fill this these gaps. I'm making so much noise. I'm so sorry. Um, yeah, so we've got a little bit of space, which is obviously good because that means that I've got room to grow. So when I do get new products from there, I'm going to zoom out, not in. When I do get new products, it'll be good because I'll have somewhere to put them straight away. But for now, it's not ideal. I need to find something. I might even put my little nail tip box just there just to keep them still. That's all really, just like keep them in place but yeah I'm quite happy with how this is going to be fair so we've done that drawer the middle one is freshly done as well of course so it's just the bottom one I need to sort out now because I need to fit all of the Tia's Beauty stuff in this and also the stuff that I've just took out of that other drawer they're too long they're, they're just gonna actually they can sit at the back of here I'm probably not gonna use them anytime soon they can just out the back there and then we've got some random stuff like these these you can't even see i'm so sorry <laughs> i'm really not doing very well in this video am i and then we've got my pens if i do sharpie nail art or anything um so yeah i need to like rearrange this somehow because i've still got quite a few i mean i think my blue sky like colour changes and um, metallics, I'm probably just going to put in a drawer like somewhere else. I mean, to be fair, they can fit. Let me see if they're too high to go in one of the shorter drawers. Yes, they are. Of course they are, because that would be too easy. So instead, actually, I'm going to swap these. Because these need to be in one of the lower drawers because they're tall and they won't go in the ones above. Obviously, I'm not showing you the ones above because I've got names in again. But they can go in any drawer. It doesn't really make a difference for those. And then this this here is now a mess because I've just taken out these to use for one of those drawers. So I'm just going to use this 
random pot that I've got to put these things in because to be honest they're things that like I do reach for very very rarely but not very often at all so I don't really need them like really noticeable place really so I'm just going to pop them at the back of the third drawer down which is only half full but then the only problem is I've still got all of these <laughs> so they don't really need their own like storage really but you know why not let's see if I can fit them do you know what that'll do it's fine don't think sorry i'm just like thinking and talking to myself and not really talking to you which is obviously unhelpful but that would be really good if i could put that there perfect but now i've got a gap down here so that is quite annoying i think i might i don't know whether to turn these around now like so they've had a bit of a move around as well or whether to just move these over and just keep them where they are make my life easier i'm probably just going to do that i'm just going to leave these because i quite like how these are um there we go it's like nice and neat like i can quite clearly find everything it's just easy having it like this it makes it much easier for me because i'm used to where everything is now in this drawer anyway like i use i do go for this stuff quite often so i think i'm just going to leave that oh gosh that was aggressive i'm just going to leave it as it is now so i'm actually quite happy with being productive it's not took me like way too long which is good that's why i always film it because i always do things quicker when i know people are watching which is very handy so that is literally it let's just have a quick recap so we've got this drawer is now done got this one is now done and then we've also got this one so i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching as always and i'll be back soon with another one bye